Formula E weekend, my brick. Check it, let me show you, let me show you, let me show you. Check it, check it, check it, check it. Watch. There, my bro. There it is. Ah. Well, that's the fan village. That's where we're gonna vibe with the fans and we're gonna chill. And there's the beautiful stadium, bruh. Cape Town is looking sexy today. My word. What beautiful weather. Okay, the clouds is a bit of a concern, but it's fine. It's fine. It's gonna be a good day. Check yourself, eh? Send that do's and don'ts, right? So the do's and don'ts was apparently that you shouldn't bring a professional camera in it. You know, no professional camera, so I'm like, maybe hey, do a vlog. I still have comments, I said, because I'm a vlogger. And I have a DSLR camera, will that be allowed? And then they responded and they said, like, check here, as long as there's no extra lenses and time. Check here. And we all know what that means. That basically means, yes, sir, you are allowed to bring your camera as long as we don't find your other lenses. I mean, we all know that's what that, what that means, that's what I heard, you know? Oh my gosh, brush my hair now. Maybe I'll just put the cap on. Yeah, good enough. Alright, having said all of that, it's time to go and do game plan. It's about to get executed. I'm going to put you in the bag now. And don't worry, if all goes well, no? I think I'm going to see you on the inside now. Okay, here's the bag. I'm going to put this in there. Don't worry, but I'm going to see you inside. I legit didn't think that Cape Town is capable of something like this. I did have little hope, I'm not gonna lie. There's a lot going on, corrupt government, freaking load shedding, all of that stuff. Didn't think Cape Town was gonna pull it off. And it's freaking vibing bro. Like, they're really getting it right, bro. No cap. Food is all liquor. So my friend is supposed to be here around 11 a.m. Just waiting for him and then, yeah. And the vibe a bit more. I know there's little footage. But this is coming though. I've never watched a single race of Formula in my life, right? But just like, I'm a big F1 fan. And this is the closest thing Cape Town's gonna get to F1. I'm not gonna argue with that, but I'm gonna freaking go, you know? But I'm gonna finish eating. I don't want you to guys watch me eat me. Do you think like if you look at this, you know, it's quite like professional. What do you think like Cape Town pulling or something like this? It's like old class, old class events. It's not bad, no? No, I mean they've done well. That's yeah, why we can host a Formula The Formula 1? One. One. Oh, that'll be dope, man. Because they were saying that they're surprised that they still make use of the yeah. stadium, like that they kept it up and everything. Yeah. Cape Town is we're capable, bro. Check him and I did a hot lap now, no, but Leiden didn't record me. So I'm going to record Leiden now doing his lap.
was sick, bro. Oh my word. Leiden first experience. I was out formerly. Uh, it was it was quite amazing. It was um, I think yeah. it's quite a show. Definitely shows that uh, we can host big events. Yeah, like Cape Town is capable. You know? Yeah, no, it's, definitely. Um, Are you coming next year again? Definitely. I will be here next year as well. Really? I'll be on the finish start. Okay, I'm, can I sit with you? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yo, listen, Cape Town really outdid themselves with this one. This was freaking epic, my bro. It looks like freaking, it literally looks like Formula One, bro. Like Formula One can literally like make themselves on their way this way to Cape Town. And as the sun goes down on this fantastic event, that was Cape Town Formula E, E pre Cape Town Electric. As you can see there, um, this was fantastic, my bro. Cape Town knows how to do it. Um, my homie Lyron was with me. Hopefully we get more homies next year, my bro. Be fantastic. So yeah, yeah. There's no footage, bro. I'm sick of vlogging, bro. It's like to just enjoy the place and enjoy the event for yourself. See you guys next time.